back to your mom. Hmm. Here we go. Aya, aya. Let's dance. Let's do it. Watcha, watcha. against those who laughed at me! I'm heading off to practice! Okay. <gasps> Is Aki here? Huh? Hey, that's my pudding. There are monkeys all throughout the town. They're all over the TV. Uh, Anyway, anyway, this is huge! Hey, that hurts! Okay, there you are! Huh? That doesn't sound like a recording! Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Aki! Hey! Yumi! Oh, I'm so glad you're both safe! Natalie? Details later, but here's what's happening. Alright. Those monkeys are loose again! They're out causing trouble all over the world! This time, they're broadcasting weird television shows. That sounds kind of fun. No! Their shows are so stupid that anyone watching becomes a mindless couch potato. Now, I don't want to scare you. But as you can see, Spike and Jimmy and even the professor have all been affected. Oh, my. If this continues, the monkeys will affect the whole world. Kay, Yumi, you're going to have to help us. Capture those monkeys and put an end to their mindless TV shows. I'm teleporting a monkey net to you. Use it to capture all of the monkeys. Be careful and good luck. Hey, stop! Cut it out! I hope Natalie will be okay. Well, at least now we know why things are so strange in town. That's the first time I've seen one of those monkeys. The teleport is complete. I guess it wasn't just one of Natalie's bad jokes. Oh my! Hurry! Capture him! Good job! Captured monkey teleportation complete! Just what's going on here? I guess. I guess that everything Natalie said was true. I guess that those monkeys are causing havoc all over the world. We have to capture all of those monkeys and stop their TV shows. Yumi, Kay, we need the two of you. Huh? Will you help us? Sure! Of course! Welcome back. Capturing all of those monkeys must have been tiring, eh? I figured huh? you'd be exhausted, so I made this new device for you. Yeah. If you use this, you can change into lots of different forms. Different forms? Huh, like what? <laughs> Why don't you just try it and see? I think you'll be happy with what you can do. Really? Of course. Cool. I'm still putting the finishing touches on it, but it should be done in time for the next stage. Huh. Well, I'll let you know what it will change you into then, okay? <laughs> ah! <laughs> so, there are still some humans who haven't been affected yet. Here, try this! You're 
are supposed to be frightened. This dragon has rained fiery death upon many a valiant knight. Are you sure about that? He looks kind of goofy. What? You dare to belittle my greatest creation? This will not do! We're the ones that should be saying that. You fix everybody that you've hurt right now! Ha! There's no way that's going to happen! I have orders to affect everyone in the whole world! What do you mean, orders? Orders from who? Ha 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 ha! From Spectre, of course! Who else? Spectre? Whoops! Oh, I forgot that it was against the rules to say his name! You little brat! This is all your fault! You're the one who said it! Shut up! Well, now that you know our secret, I'm afraid that I can't allow you to leave here. I was about to make a movie starring myself, but I guess that will have to wait. Change the scenario! Your time has come, brat! Well, well. Things have become quite interesting, haven't they? Shall I go and say hello? An exquisite idea. Very well, I shall go get ready. Please wait here for a bit. So, again Spectre is behind all of this. Who's Spectre? That name sounds familiar. You two don't know him? Spectre is an ultra-intelligent monkey that wants to rule over all mankind. Somewhat dangerous. He used to be one of the most popular monkeys at the monkey park. But he turned to evil when he put on a monkey helmet, and now he's become the boss of the evil monkeys. I'm no mere boss. The... I'm their glorious leader. Obviously, you aren't fans of my show. Spectre? Spectre? So you're the one behind all of this. Just what is it that you want? I heard that someone dared to stand in my way, so I wanted to get a look at who it could be. I must say I'm quite relieved it's only you. What? Why you? Surrender now while you still can! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> you think you can capture me again? I won't make the same mistake as before. This time I've teamed up with this Hugh. And... Do you mean me, Mr. Spectre? That's right, I am human, yet the end of humanity. These monkeys have won me over. I am the ultimate scientist. I'm 28 years old, single. I'm six foot three, including hair. I'm 145 pounds, also including hair. My favorite color is turquoise, and I have an IQ of 1300. And they call me Dr. Tomoki. And don't you forget it. What do you think you're doing? Just introduce yourself normally. Normally, cut the camera. I cut. thought it was cut. an exquisite cut. introduction. Cut. Huh. Anyway, we have nothing to fear from you fools. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> it's Tamaki. How have you been? Huh? You uh -huh. always had a good head on your shoulders. Uh, uh, Aki? Huh? Um, yes. <clears throat> Right. Well, Spectre, we can't waste the entire day talking to these people. We have work to do. Huh? Uh, oh, right. So anyway, relax and enjoy our show. Of course, if you insist on resisting us, we'll be glad to crush you like vermin. Ciao. Bye bye Hey, Aki! Are you friends with that guy? Well, once, long ago... <laughs> But never mind that now. We've got to capture Spectre. Huh? What the? Were you looking for me, kid? Your sheriffing days are over. Ain't nobody faster than me when it comes to slapping iron, kid. Pretty sure of yourself, aren't you? You wanna try me? <laughs> 
I'll be famous when I put you down. Then I'll... I'll ask Pink out for a date. And then... <laughs> you ready, kid? As soon as this music box stops, we draw! Here we go! They've captured Blue Tomoki! This isn't going well! Not to worry, Mr. Spectre! We still have broadcast stations all over the world! Indeed! And there are still three more of the Freaky Monkey Five! The next one is sure to stop them! <laughs> Who are you? Oh, dear! <laughs> Haven't I seen you on TV? Well, I don't know. Maybe. Oh! I do so hate you cutesy types! Oh, really? Is that so? Hmm... You must just love yourself, then. Well, now, <laughs> quite sure of yourself, aren't you? <laughs> well, there are plenty of prettier girls than you, you know. Oh, yeah? Have you seen my ratings lately? <laughs> Have you seen your waistline lately? Check your ratings again after the paparazzi get a shot of that. <laughs> oh, but that doesn't matter now. Dr. Spectre has asked that I take care of you here and now. <laughs> well, come on. Let's see what you got. Oh, dear, dear, dear. You're losing that cutesy image. <laughs> Don't underestimate me. They've taken out Yellow. What now, Tomoki? <laughs> Tomoki? Where is your mind at? Hey, can you hear me? Oh, Spectre, baby! I can hear you just fine, sweetie. Those pesky humans have gotten yellow. Uh, you mean that fat... I mean, monkey yellow? No way! Well, it serves him right. I'll be showing off like that trying to outdo me. Well, the next time I meet him, I... Uh, Pink. Whoops! Was I thinking out loud again? I really need to stop doing that. Listen up. New orders. You cannot let those humans get by you. Oh, baby, you know I've got a rehearsal after this. Baby? Well, just who do you think you're talking to? I just gave you an order! <laughs> <laughs> hmm? Is this a stage? Ladies and gentlemen, we are proud to present the diva of the Freaky Monkey Five. Her beautiful face is enough to drive any monkey wild. And now, here she is in her first lead in a musical performance, Monkey Pink. Hey, you. Wait just a minute. They say you caught yellow, right? Um, uh, well, yeah, I guess. Good for you. Well, you're pretty good, aren't you? Oh, no, it's nothing. I... But I'm sorry to say there's only room for one at the top. Eh? I sing, I dance, I even act. It's only natural that I be the one at the top! And now, my first musical! Watch! And know that you will never be as great as I! So, are you ready to finally give up and admit that I'm better than you? Give up? Give up? No. I will never give up! Just let me capture you! I said never! I'm going off to train now. I'll come back for you. I'll come back stronger than ever! You! You've destroyed my dreams of becoming a superstar! You'll pay for this! I swear you will! Hey, where'd she go? Yumi?
Looks like that one got away. But at least the Spectre TV broadcasts have stopped in this area, so I guess you've done well. Come on back home. Yeah! Okay! Tomoki! Has Pink come back? No, she hasn't actually. Now, where could she have gone off to? Well now, little girl, I'm surprised you've made it this far. Who are you? An excellent question. I'm the number one Hollywood action star, Monkey Red. Such power, such agility. Yes, I am indeed an entirely new breed of action star. My kung fu is much, much greater than yours. Oh, really? Let's hear you say that again, after you've been beaten by a little girl. Moki, all of the Freaky Monkey Five have been defeated! Hmm, well, it seems that we'll have to take things to the next level. Are your preparations complete? Well, of course, Mr. Spectre. I wouldn't say such things if they weren't. <laughs> 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 Yumi? It looks like Spectre is somewhere deep in this area. In Tomoki Tower, I think. If we can capture Spectre, then we can stop all of the broadcasts. Be sure to get him. Okay, gotcha. Oh, and one more thing. Tomoki should be with Spectre, too. That guy with the strange head? <laughs> well, I'm not sure what he's up to, but you'd better be careful. Welcome, welcome to my exquisite lair! <gasps> Dr. Dr. Tomoki! That's right! Where's Spectre? So sorry to disappoint. Mr. Spectre is no longer here. He's quite busy, you know. Well, no matter. In either event, your broadcasting station is finished! Yeah! No use resisting. We have you! <laughs> Just wait until you see what we have in store for you. The Spectre TV project that you two tried to stop was just the beginning. Our real plan begins now. Our real plan. None other than the Double Paradise Plan. While everyone is helpless from our Spectre TV, we will launch from our giant base in orbit around the Earth. A huge... Hold on there, Dr. Uh, Tomoki. That is quite enough. Oh, uh, right. Well, if it isn't, my dear friend, Mr. Spectre. Thank you for your advice, sir. Don't you think it's about time to take care of these meddling fools? Exquisite <laughs> idea. You just stay there and watch this. Indeed I will. Indeed. I'm so sorry, but your time is now up. I need at least this much firepower to fight with you two. Or to look at it another way. I'm showing respect to you both for making it this far. Huh? It's from Aki! I thought that you two might be able to make good use of the robot and flying turtle about now. Use these in your fight. An explanation for this. I was on the monkey helmet research team with the professor. 
Then one day, during an experiment, an accident caused my head to... Well, become like this. That's what did it! What led my life astray! <laughs> Go ahead, laugh. I know you want to. Oh, you poor man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> plan is still on. And it's not like you'll ever manage to reach me here. Hey, how does it feel to be so helpless, huh? Have fun sitting there sucking your thumbs. Hmm. Ciao. Au revoir. Spectre, I'm gonna... What are we going to do Don't now? Don't you worry. Huh? I'll help you. You will? But first, please shake my hand. Your kind words meant a lot to me. I will take you to Mr. Spectre's place. <laughs> Space Tomoki, Mark 1. Launch! And we're off to limitless outer space! To outer space? Wow! Look, you two. We can see it now. The moon? Look carefully. Behind the moon. What is it's it? It's huge! Spectre? Do you mean to tell me... That's right! That's where Mr. Spectre is! Right there in Space Station Sato 3! Prepare for entry! <laughs> I've grown tired of waiting for you. Spectre! You apologize to this wig dude! Yeah. What do I care about Tomoki's feelings, eh? My plans have reached their final stage. Double Paradise Plan thing? Just what's that all about? Why not? I'll tell you. This space station, the Saru 3, is equipped with a chop rocket. I will launch it and chop the world! Right in two, right down the middle. After that, I was going to give one of the halves to Tomoki. But now I think I'll just let you humans fight over it. So what do you think? Both a brilliant and peaceful solution, huh? That's my double paradise plan. I'll accept your thanks. Now, aw, oh, what's wrong? Monkey got your tongue? What are you talking about? Even you monkeys won't be able to live on the Earth if you do that! Yeah! You're gonna bust up the whole planet! You can't fool me! I'm more powerful than I ever was! Switch on! <laughs> So you're getting serious now. Very well. And so now, come and watch the finale of my double paradise plan. And stay out of the way. We did it, Kay! Yeah! But I can't seem to shake this feeling that I've forgotten something. Yeah! <laughs> What could it be? Hey, Kay! What do you think you're laughing at? Wait just a huh? minute, boys and girls. Have you forgotten about the chop rocket? If we don't do something, the Earth will be split in two. Oh, right! right. Not to worry, though. Who better to stop the chop rocket than I, its creator? There is a spacecraft down on the lower deck. You two can use it to get back to Earth. Hurry now! Go! There's no time! Okay! We're relying on you! See you later, wig dude! Good luck, Dr. Tomoki! <laughs> Until we meet again! Leave this thing up to me! I lied. We'll never meet again. Once the rocket has been engaged, it cannot be stopped. <laughs> Unless, that is, I use the self-destruct system that's mounted in this space station. Identity confirmed. Beginning self-destruct sequence. Computer! Status report on the escape rocket. Status launch. Okay, self-destruct sequence B, start. My, I have 
felt so good about myself in years. I'm so glad that I met you. Okay. You me. Thank you. Goodbye. Why, if it isn't number 1182. So you've come to spend our last few minutes together. Silly little thing. Here we go. where Spectre is. It looks like not all of Space Station Saru 3 was destroyed. Spectre has been hiding out in a piece of it. Is this the last time we'll have to face him? Kay! We have to capture Spectre! Duh! Of course! We're counting on both of you. Hmm! You bet! You can count on us! Spectre! It's time for you to give up! Yeah! Before you get hurt! Huh? What the... What do you mean? Just as you see, I give up. You've beaten me. I am surrendering. Well, all right then. Well, come on, come on. Arrest me. Take me in. Well, okay then. Huh? Hang on a second! Fools! Ah! <laughs> I got you! I got you! So how does it feel to be captured yourselves? You tricked us! Tricked you? Oh, come on now! It's called strategy. Strategy. Didn't I tell you that I'm much smarter than before? 
<laughs> oh, I do love comebacks. So you're an agent, huh? Sure are one brave little monkey. Pretty sharp eyes you've got there. Anyway, I guess we've brought the world back from the brink of catastrophe. And it was all due to you. <laughs> By the way, we haven't been properly introduced yet. I'm Snake. You can call me that from now on. And you? Interesting. A pair of snakes. Nice to meet you, Snake. I think we're going to get along just fine. Okay. I'm off to Colonel Campbell's place to report on the mission. What are you going to do now? Is that right? Well, I guess that's the way it goes. We'll probably meet again somewhere. Thank you.